Hello and welcome back to Radiant Dawn Randomized. So I actually had to play the last chapter again because I forgot to save, but I did uh, get some supports I wanted. So it was uh, Titanian Horror together, Riz uh, unlocked a support with Ileana, and I decided to support some other people just for like the next chapter if I have uh, room to bring them. Um, anyway, we're going to do some promotions today. So first I'm going to go with Heather since I never use her or promote her. Uh, we did get a Master Crown from all of the tents last time, so let's go ahead and use that we can. By the way, uh, I did max her out as well um, with bonus XP, so let me just show you Heather really quick. So yeah, she maxed out everything but luck, but I don't really care about that, so we're going to promote her. And then to Tanya, I got to level 20. Uh, here she is, max skill, so we'll um, promote her as well, and I forged her a lance. And yeah, let's just go back to Heather and... Get our first tier 3 unit of this. Well, not including Alencia, I guess, but our first actual promotion to a tier 3. Should be pretty helpful to have a um, Arc Sage on the team. And she will be able to use staves, too, to help out Eliana. And hopefully she'll look better than that. Edward got a pretty good glow up. Can you. Not real. It actually looks the same. But she's tier 3 now, so that's all good. So yeah, really cool with that. Uh, let's just check her out. So yeah, really fast mage. Um, certainly enjoying that. And let's go ahead and give the bonus experience to Titania so she can promote as well. And what we saw in the the second chapter, Lyra is also a Falcon Knight, so I might want to try and use her too. We do have to find out what Keys is, though. A lot more blue than I thought she would be. And really nice. So yeah, tier 3 flyer, tier 3 mage should be pretty fun going here on out. And I did uh, do all of the other preparations. This time I will save before we start. Uh, there was a cutscene at the end of the last one. I tried to like get out of that because I think it might have spoiled to barn for me. Uh, let's just skip through. Speak of the, the cutscenes. And let's see. So let's go choose units. Um, so Renolf... Uh, we saw was an axe general in um, the prologue. Uh, by the way, this map here is the map where Ike and Renolf cannot spawn to cavalry units because they do have to arrive at um, an arrival point, but it requires them to climb a ledge. So I'll show that off in a minute because I want to see what keys a uh, sword general, so kind of like Meg, um, are getting a lot of generals as well. Uh, we have a Boyd and Nephni still. Uh, Max out speed though is pretty good. I might have to compare him to Nephni. Um, and then Liar should be here too. Yeah, here she is. She's a Falcon Knight as well. Um, a lot more room to grow than Titan. She has Earth Affinity, so I think I might want to actually try and use her. I don't know how good she will be in the whole long run. I, you don't really get a chance to use Liar because she is really bad. Um, Cats, as I mentioned with Ike, probably the worst class in the game. And she uh, is worse than her counterpart, Renolf, who is forced on this map. So yeah, Kiza, um... And then Nefni, uh, Nefni looks a little bit better. And then Boyd is also a sword general, so he might actually, hmm. He's not as strong as Boyd though, but he is a lot faster. I do have Boyd, uh, Boyd's support with Ike though, so that's kind of like uh, important. So let's see who we're going to bring. Um, yeah, I'm benching Rolf this time. He didn't really do too much last chapter. We have Leth and Mordecai too, and I don't really know if I want to use him, but I do want to bring Liar. Um, let's see. As much as I don't want to bench Kiza right away, I, I do want to use Liar because she's just kind of fun. Um, don't know if I have any other items for her to use. I didn't really buy anything, I just, um, we have a wind edge here, I guess we can give to her. Okay, so let's check out this map here. So yeah, the, uh, point is, usually, um, flying har up here, he could solo this side. We do have some loose to help us out. But, uh, Ike and his team usually want to climb up this ledge to, well, both these ledges to get here. And you're still a general, I believe you're a general in, uh, Vanilla as well, which is kind of disappointing. But you have a Worm Slayer and a Brave Lance, um... 
Luckily, we don't have a... Well, we do have plenty of dragons, but Ike isn't one of them. Uh, we can get the Etard here, another Etard, but Ike... Uh, well, can't use it, but someone else might be able to use it since I did uh, unlock it to be given to anyone. Um, let's see what these guys have. Kaviz, Night Tide. Yeah, we have to beat both of these guys, and I can roll have to arrive on these squares together. There's no turn limit, but um, because of how this map is, Oscar and Titania usually get stuck around here. So, yeah, I th there is some kind of like safety on this um, randomizer, so Ike and Renolf have to be able to climb ledges, or else this would be impossible to win. Um, right, yeah, I, I do want to give Lyra a chance. I also have to remember to turn on animations, because when I, um, yeah, when I uh, replayed that, I had to just turn off animations. It's a little easier. Uh, right. Now, I do want to send some people up here. So, I guess to Tanya and Har, since they are support, they can go this way. Um, Ileana might follow them around to help out. Um, right. And then everyone else can go the other way. Uh, Heather, I did give her a staff already. So, we have two healers to go either way, which is really helpful. I guess we are good for now. I think Shinon and Gaytree do have some stones on them still, because they are still pretty useful. And we'll see if Liar can do anything here, so... Yeah, I know there are a few bows on this map. We will have to check skills. Um, hopefully none of these guys have spawned with a meteor tome, like the boss did last time. That was uh, kind of a surprise. Yeah, I kind of just want to check them as I go to them because there's so many of them. But let's just go ahead and save and begin since we have our preparations done. Uh, if I fail this, I can just pick up right away. Alright, so as it turns out, these Ballista um, really put us in check because, yeah, my team is mostly flyers. And uh, this guy can reach pretty far, so I will have to be wary of... Uh, Har and Titania. Not so much Riz, but Riz gets doubled. So I did a little change. So Liar absolutely sucks. So I brought her sister instead left. Uh, she's a lot better than Mia and Boyd, or not Boyd, Oscar as a black, or as a dragon prince. So she might be a bit more helpful than um, Liar. Anyway, uh, Riz here gets doubled, which is not good. He is falling off pretty hard because, um, yeah, in my uh, last attempt, he only leveled up Luck, which isn't really that great. But Heather, on the other hand, uh, fantastic. So let's check out a tier 3 unit once again. She doesn't really look different. Um, and she's not going to gain a lot of XP, obviously, either. So don't really want to feed her kills, but she will look anything we need. Uh, most of the uh, hits for now will be taken by the cats and tigers around the map. They have, for some reason, they do love to get critical. I don't know why, but they, they do. Um, I'm going to sh... I move Renolf in. He also seems pretty good, actually. I should probably get him different axes. Leth actually has a axe on her I can trade around. Yeah, yeah. She had a silver axe in her inventory, so um, I traded that to Nefni, and we're just going to shift right now, so yeah. Although she's orange, she is a black dragon, so yeah, a lot better than um, a lot better than uh, the other two. Although I'm probably still going to bring them to the, um, see the Silver Axe. Still probably going to bring them to other maps if we need it. I know the um, defense chapter coming up. I believe that one's next. Um, we do need quite a few units to double with anything else. We do need a few units to plug up the uh, holes because we will have a uh, ledge advantage next chapter. I usually do bring like scrubs on not training to help out in that regard. Yeah, and I, uh, the, yeah, the Mercurius I felt was better on Har, since I do want to actually use Har. I don't really care to use. I don't know. I could support Ike and Renolf instead of Void, because, uh, yeah, Ike and Renolf actually do have an ending together, so it might make more sense. Although it's not as popular as the other ending Ike has, but... I actually don't think I've ever done Ike Renolf, so that could be interesting. He is pretty good, though. He, um, gives Nefni some competition, which is interesting. So I don't know if I'll actually have two generals. He's a lot stronger than her. He's only a little bit slower. Um, and they a bit more tanky, too. So if he gets his speed going, he'll, um, no doubt he will because he's Renolf. Uh, both of them will be a force to be reckoned with, and I really can't wait to use them. Um, okay, I think this guy does not get doubled, so I'm gonna have to 
let's bring Ike over as well. Ike has to go this way. Yeah, I'm going to try and go for Ike and Ulf. I, as much as I really like Boyd's design here, uh, I, I don't know how good he's going to be in the long run. Gatro will no doubt be helpful because, yeah, he can actually resist this stupid ballista. Shinon, um, not so much. We do have a few other Lagoo Stones from our party that just joined us. I'm going to have to brave Lance you, actually. Which is a bit of a shame, but oh well. I don't think I burned through as much in my re-attempt as I did on my uh, on-camera attempt. We do have a Hammer but I don't know what's going to be worth it. I mean, this certainly will to help Titania just double really fast units like this. Okay, um... And Ileana's going to go this way. Since Heather can heal now, uh, Ileana can have some help. She's mostly going to be doing her same role. And, uh... Okay, you have Adept. Same role in healing. I didn't... I didn't... Well, I did check their skills in my last attempt. Okay, yeah, definitely have to take out that archer right there. Although, Titania can actually survive an archer pretty well. She did get shot by re-attempt, but she, um, did survive, so it's all good. And get rid of you. Cool. Yeah, Liar being a flyer here for the ballista is also not good, because she can only advance so far. Okay, that was a regular death, but these cats have a tendency to get critical very easily for some reason. I guess they have really low luck. And speaking of luck, I'm glad you're in uh, Titania's support range right now. Okay, well, that's fine. Titania can get the archer. Barely did anything. But he is taking a beating, so yeah, we can't really use these guys forever as sponges. They do die in most of my attempts. Oh, they are pretty heal happy too. They will. They're not shy about using their vulnerabilities. If they have them. Okay, thank you for killing the adept guy, and you're actually blocking away. And they do have a tendency to run back towards healers if they should survive. I have seen them, like, gather around mist before. Yeah, that cat right there really likes to get critical. It's kind of funny. Okay. You look a lot like Charizard. Alright, so once again, I'm gonna do this every turn too, because uh, I actually lost to Tanya to this guy, because he shot a little... He can reach this ledge, which uh, kind of sucks, but oh well. If I can get you to kill this guy... Free kill for Har. Yeah, they do a nice job of weakening it, at the very least. How far up is Har actually in um, level? He's pretty... Nowhere near as close as Tatania was, that's for sure. Okay, yeah, Gaetri had a terrible hit right against these guys, but Shinon is around, luckily. I had Shinon shove Ileana a bit um, in my failed attempt. Okay, he hit that time. Good. I actually can't reach quite yet. And pokey stick. Oh, just one off. Yeah, so Titania normally is stopped by these ledges, but now she's stopped by the ballistas, which also sucks. Yeah, even at tier 3, she does get one shot. Not many flying people can survive a ballista, except for, like, Tabarn. If oh, I'd have Tabarn right now, that would be fun. Um, right, looks like there's... Yeah, Shinon's also stuck. Patriot can at least get this ledge. Uh, Lethazard. Not going anywhere too far. Let me check out these guys' skills. So, quick law... Nothing too scary, fortunately. Yeah, he has all the Lagoos items, and, uh, not a Lagoos. 
Uh, no one around here needs healing, so I'll just let Heather hang out. Um, maybe Les can draw the Ballista. I'm thinking it would be a good idea for Riz to as well, since he did kind of draw out that bolting guy last time. Him getting doubled is a serious problem, and you're going to get ledged. But that guy doesn't have anyone to stand next to him and block the ledge. Yeah, they're all actually going to die of this tiger because he's blocking away. I could have Heather healed him, actually. It would be a bad idea. Uh, no crit on the cat. Yeah, these cats have really abysmal luck. Another game where I'm... Well, they're not dominant here, so... That's at least one good thing. I don't remember if this tiger moves or if he kind of stays stationary. I know that one right there in front of Titania. Um, that one will go back to Mist if he needs healing. Okay, yes, please take out the archers. <laughs> and you can one-shot this guy. Yep. Sealing my kills, but it's fine. So yeah, this is where Titania can't stand, so... I think she died on the square that that tiger standing on last time, so it kind of sucks that all of my good units are, well, incapacitated here. Yeah, you have a stupid longbow. Um, we can reach this square at least, but I don't want to get shot by him either. Yeah, these guys are really stuck. Um, I guess Eliana can heal up to Tanya. Just drink up some grass, I guess. Unfortunately, your parrot partner is not going to be able to come with you. And no more reason to spam recover and mend with Eliana now that she's promoted. Okay, um... I really would love to check out Renolf, too. Uh, I do have to shut you off for a second. I don't want Ike getting in that range, either, and uh, Left can't really reach because, yeah, she's pretty slow. I need to stay on. I don't want Ike to get hit by this. Um, I guess Heather can... Oh yeah, show his heal. I think I could put a... Well, she's pretty powerful, so she heals a lot. I think she does have a... Uh, she's an E in stave, so yeah, I might not be able to get her anything better at the moment. I'm hoping... kind of wish, um, Riz was a good target for this. Yeah, because these guys really can't do anything with all these bows around here. Okay, hopefully that tiger takes him out next time. Okay, thank you for going for the tiger, not, uh, Renolf. He looks pretty cool. I mean, I think he looks better than Nephne. I think his leg flesh is kind of creepy. It's like his hat mixed with his fur. Or is his hat on his face? I don't know. Uh, who are you going for? Ike. Okay. No crit yet on the cats. They actually both got crit on my failed attempt, which is interesting. And yeah, now they're on shifting, so cool. Okay, good. Kill this guy. At least I can fly up a little bit closer. Okay, good. Kill yourself. That's fine. I'm fine with you running away. Uh, let's turn these guys back on yet. Yeah, kind of forgot that there was a billion bows in this map. Yeah, Leth does pretty well against these guys. So let's check her out again. We did see her back in part two, but... She's a lot better than the other two, I find. And she can still do what she needs to do and hit hard so someone else can get this kill. Would love for Renolf to actually uh, do a bit more here. Yeah, 
Another fast general. I'm really liking them both. Will I bring two generals to the tower? Maybe. And we will need someone to withstand these bows. We do have two more slots since Kurt and Ina have been uh, taken off. Although Kurt and Ego Ina might spawn as really good units too. Who knows? All uh, right. Nephew or brand new. She actually doesn't have the strength to. Wow, that's a pain in the butt. It's not enough to kill Ike. Yeah, I need Nancy's strength to be a little bit better. Amy actually had a um, energy drop in her shop. It was like 8,000. I don't know if I should have bought it, but I would like Nephi's strength to get a little higher. Not being able to kill that guy with those silver axe is a little embarrassing, but it is what it is. And if Heather gets hit, she can heal herself on her self-healing staff. He'll probably go for that tiger, I imagine. Which may be Riz. Yeah, I wish I could do more. Um, so yeah, I've got them both highlighted, so it is at least safe for our guys to get up here, but there's really not much else they can do unless this guy runs out of Ballista. Um, I guess you can push Eliana. <laughs> oh, didn't really help get her up the ledge, and Riz can just be Ballista fodder, hopefully. It's pretty safe right there, actually. I think that tiger is uh, kind of dead, though. Yeah, I figured you'd go for this guy. Cool. <laughs> well, better them than us. Well, Titania, it looks like you're walled off again. I mean, a lot of the map is cleared out. Um, stuck up there, so I know there's reinforcements that show up from the top. Uh, I guess I can try and have Ileana heal you, unless you do it yourself. Okay, we can just heal ourselves. Cool. It's a good way to get some, a little bit of experience, though. Okay, so this is a real pain. This is where having, um... Well, Har actually gets checked by these guys as well, so I'm gonna try and maybe bait them out on someone. Let's see, who has really good resistance here? Uh, you have 14. I don't know if I want Heather to do it since she... Uh, Leth has a ton, so I'm going to see if they'll maybe go for Leth. Yeah, Leth outshining her sister. What else is new? Um, Ike probably wants to drink up another grass. I don't want him really getting... ...attacked by this. Um, I think we're good over here on this guy. Yeah, even though he has this half shift, still having to, like, chug a grass is not ideal. And I guess you can get more healing staff in uh, on you. Why not? I really don't want Heather to be just a healer. I definitely prefer her fighting, but uh, if there's nothing else to do, I might as well get experience this way. Alright, there's Elfire Mages, unfortunately, which is not good for... Not really good for Gaytree here. He's really the only one aside from Void who can get up here. That is out of range. Yeah, I really don't trust Riz either because he just gets doubled by everything. I don't think there's anything that will... I jumped. I might be able to put him up here safely. Um, I don't want Nephi to deal with these either. I just want to see if they uh, actually take the bait with Leth. Once again, I don't think Leth is really going to be endgame worthwhile because she... Well, is a uh, non roll to do, but she certainly will be worthwhile here, I think. Uh, going for Gaytree with this stupid tiger. No, they didn't go for it. Well, that's a bummer. Well, you've drinking all your boners. She can get up here, though. Now, does anyone have any, like, scary skills? Well, you have counter. Scary, you're not scary. You are a little scary. Okay. She can't really one shot though, that's the problem. Um Yeah, she has to do yeah, trying to get past these guys is kind of a pain since they're well. I'm wondering if 
you can like pray back this guy and get out. That might be a good play. I just need to make sure he can canto out of this one's range. We have what? Nine movement? Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. You can get diagonal on this guy. Okay, I actually do need Riz here to do this. It's really not safe for Leth either. I mean, she's not invincible like Alencia was back in 2 Endgame. But being a flyer still has its uses, luckily for her. Ah, uh, Riz, I almost called him R again. Okay. Yeah, it's out of your range. Um... There's a lot of damage Leth would have to take. I mean, she could try and go up this. I really wish I had um, a support for her. Okay, nice. And she did guess an item. Okay, another coin. Whoop de doo. <laughs> Yay, a coin. Yay. What can you get to? Okay, you're not that scary. I should probably turn on you again. Yeah, I really, really have to pay attention to these idiots. Who else is in range here? I think you're the only one. Um, okay. Let me heal up you. I think I'll have uh, an old trade around your items. Does Ike have to seriously drink another grass? He may have to. I really just don't want him to unshift. I mean, he can go right back, but I'd rather not. Uh, why isn't this guy highlighted? Oh, I think he's out. Thank goodness. Well, that should make it a lot easier for these guys down here. I really want Har, <clears throat> Har to get back in it. Tatanya can't reach. No, we don't want to converse. <laughs> I get really tired of seeing that all the time. I mean, it's such a, like, generic-looking, like, conversation, too, so it's not really all that worthwhile to see. Like, they just basically swap the names, and, like, it's so nice to see you, name. Let's stick together. Like, we can literally have that with anyone else. I don't know if Shinon... That might be in range. It's not enough, though. Guys are pretty bold. Um, easy. Oh, God, another resolve guy. I am so tired of every enemy having resolve. He's gonna be a problem. Uh, we actually can't get up here, and anyone I definitely can't get up here. Um, I guess I can hang out here. Okay, going for Riz. You're probably gonna double me. Okay, no, you're still too slow. If we had a speed wing, um, Riz would be a good candidate. You're gonna... yeah. Oh, this guy's gonna be annoying. I might want to let the tiger deal with him. They are definitely going for me now instead of the stupid tiger. Can we hit a 56 again? Okay, good. Nice. Ugh, the counter guy. Yuck. 
And you're gonna block my way to get up there. But yes, please deal with him. Thank you. Thank you so much for your help. I, I do appreciate you. And this guy has to die, but I think he might be in... Let me check out this, um... Yeah, here comes the wyvern, so... <laughs> Reinforcements, Joy. Gotta keep checking these guys out. I don't think really any of these guys... Can... I can get in there, but he... He has to, uh, drink up again. Well, good luck when I'm on the same level as you. Yeah, I kind of knew left would be better than the other two, but... Yeah, she has that sort of semi-royal privilege being a prince. And my generals can't make it. <laughs> Alright, Ike, drink up. There you go. <laughs> Alright, you guys need to climb up next turn. Um, just need to make sure all good here. Uh, do you guys spawn with anything scary? Not really. Um, what about you? I don't think you had anything scary either. If I bring Titania in, he might be able to... Let's see. Not enough. That's so annoying. Really want hard to get these once again. I'd love for him to kill this guy. Okay. There we go. Please just go for the tiger instead of me. Alright, good. Another one for Har. More strength. Always appreciate on a Pegasus. Alright, who is in range? Who is in range? Probably these guys. Actually, is he in range of this guy? can't really tell. Uh, it might be the- who is he in range of? Is it you? I cannot see who he's in range of at all. Oh, it's probably the wyvern. Okay. Let me just double check. I'm very paranoid about these stupid archers because, yeah, they- uh, I killed Sonya. She can get right next to that tiger. And Boyd's slowly making his way up here. Kind of funny. Um, I'm gonna keep you near Shin on. dragon foe here, like Kieran had to deal with. Yeah, it's getting to the point where I'm failing, like, every chapter at least once, which is kind of annoying, and yeah, this guy's gonna double because, yeah, even Leth isn't all that fast. Ow. That's actually big damage to Ike. Yeah, another situation where ledge mechanic is definitely working against us. Oh, nice gauge can double you. If only Ileana did have thunder, she could definitely kill these guys, but uh, I'm kind of happy with her as a healer. And Leth is now actually a black dragon, which does look a lot better than she is looking right now. Dragon versus dragon. We're in the sky for some reason, I guess. I don't know. I think all flying enemies do default to that. Okay, let's just run around like idiots. <laughs> uh, right, we need some help over here, so I need Ike to basically swap with Renolf. I need 
need some help over here. Where? Okay, I don't think there's an R turn over here anymore. I'm just going to keep you highlighted because I'm paranoid about you. I do have Titania to help out over here. Oh, that's Shimon. That one's kind of looking the same. Oh, she can just one-shot this guy. Oh, nice. They're stunned. So it is normally Alencia's personal skill. It paralyzes them, but usually it also kills them, so you don't really see the secondary effect. you and not have to worry about my meter and I can get Nefmi up here finally uh, does she have anything more accurate I did trade around her um yeah I trade around her iron axe for this so maybe not that great of an idea so I think it might actually have to be the steel More strength. Come on, catch up to Renolf. Oh, no. Well, if she caps things, I might do the Heather thing again and give her, um... Try and get her strength to be, uh... Max. Yeah, she has speed, though, so we can't complain about that. Renolf might actually be better suited to using that Silver Axe. I like his shield, too. It's kind of... I guess you can imagine the skinned cat over his shield, since it's his skin. Kind of gross, but... I don't know, everything's like, kind of like lined up perfectly on it. Generals are definitely taking over. You're both, um, your axe. You're a lance one, definitely. Alright, Ike. Come on, heal up. There you go. I don't know if I should really be using my forge, but it's fun to do. I don't know, maybe it's the sky battles that make everyone turn normal again, since the left turn normal fighting the wyvern. Could be a thing. Okay, um, I'm gonna have you actually come back and get healed. Okay. Uh, first, bishop level up. Strength on Ilya is not so boring, though. Um, yeah, I don't really want to deal with you. Do you guys have any... Press for drawing you out next. Cancel. Flare. Don't want to, okay. Uh, I don't think Sean's really going to do too much else on this map. I'd rather conserve my Lagoon's items. If you guys want to go up there and kill that guy for me, that'd be fine. Just fine. Okay. Alright. Maybe you'll come down here and fight Renolf. I'll just let I can shift. Do you need more grass? You actually might. I don't have any on you. And that should make her good for the rest of the map. Yeah, this guy is still keeping me in check. Although, um, let's see. Jatonya. How much move do you have now? Nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, she should have enough, too. Not quite enough. But we can get started at least. Or she can stun. Yeah, nice thing about having a tier 3 is she can potentially just pretty much proc a critical. I would have liked to give him that to par.
All right. Oh, that cat's gonna get roasted. I don't know if I need Gaytree more, especially since we're fighting fire mages next. So I think that Myrmidon there actually has a Worm Slayer too, so he's not going to have a good time. Well, a few of our units might not have a good time against him. I guess he's there to sort of counter Har, because most people are going to send Har up uh, one of the sides. Okay, cool. I think Nephni is still far behind Renolf, though. Uh, are you? You're not even going to. Yeah, and I think he still needs a lot more experience over Renolf. But she can make use of this silver axe. Just anything to get her a little bit more attack power. Yeah, the fire is in the way. Um. I'll just keep you here for, um, just for that Nephi support. Uh, Ike really isn't doing anything this turn either. I'll just keep him around here. And wait to have to. Okay, you actually got in my way to do this, so, um, I was gonna have to Tanya come up here and hit this guy, but, uh, that doesn't seem to be a thing since. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, he should be able to get back. Yeah, I know I shouldn't be using Jatani here. I'd really like to, love to give these to R and another stun. Nice. Um. Well, I guess we have another target to heal. All's not so bad. Uh, I think Gaetri might be done with this as well, just to keep them back. Uh, you're the Worm Slayer. I don't have anything interesting either. I will gladly take my time on these maps now that, uh, you don't have to worry about turn around. You're actually standing on something, Mr. Tiger. Ugh, he moved. Who are you going for? I actually can't tell. Uh, you're going for Nephi. Well, as a mage, you're definitely not going to double this, General. Yeah, another really low hit rate. Ah, these cats are completely useless. Is that guy going to go? Okay. Alright, where's this bow? Where is this bow, idiot? Because he is now, like... He's actually in danger of us now. Um, right. I'd love to get Renolf up this sledge. Well, I guess I can weaken you. Blocked again, but at least we're not below the ledge. Yeah, good luck. <laughs> I could have Heather just finish off this guy. She kind of needs it. Well, no, actually, Renolf needs it more since he is a tier 2, technically. I guess Heather can just... It is fine for her to not fight, though, since she, yeah, did promote already. I do need my healers in this. And hopefully we'll be able to get up this ledge eventually. Uh, Ike wants to watch out for that fire mage, though. Someone may want to bait this archer down here so we can finally get rid of him and our flowers should have free reign. I take it Skrimir is going to be a marshal. Well, no, he's not a Laguz Royal, so he might just be a very high-level general. Not really sure yet how that's going to go. 
No, I'm not gonna do that. Nice. Yeah, mage fire mages and archers have not been all that great here. Um, I have I go here and shift. He should be safe with the mage. All right. So this guy, I really want to get rid of him. Let's fly you guys out of the range. Everyone else is safe. Well, Eliana, here you go. More healing experience. Yeah, they're gathering around her like they normally do if missed. Okay, well, you've opened the spot for us to go actually attack you. And another low hit rate. What a shocker. Ike is so close. He's so close. Okay, nice. At least we can get rid of this guy. Oh, he's right there. I'm gonna have to have my flyers deal with this mage, and then I should be all safe. And you're coming this way now. That's fine. I wish Renolf could double. Well, is enough to kill you. And this should be Ike's first level up. Okay, please get something good. This is why I'm not bonus experiencing you. Uh, I guess strength on a cat is useful. I think Titania has like a perfect record now on these mages. Save some for Har, please. Although I should have had Har fight you and Titania fight the general. Uh, can anyone get up? No. No one can really get up to that square. Um, let's see. Probably heal Ike and then have someone block her. And uh, Heather's first tier 3 level up. Pretty good. Definitely take the speed once again. Uh, okay. I think I can't reach. Yeah, these generals on the sledge mechanic is not going to go well for them. Well, he can survive. If he gets hit twice. And watching this animation yet again. Begneon sure does like to send in generals, but uh, I mean, I guess they are good at blocking us, so why not? Uh, yeah, I think everyone else should be good. I don't think I have too much more healing for Liana to do. And going for Ike. <sighs> but now you have to deal with stronger Ike. Don't stand on my square, please. And you stood on my square. <sighs> Well, something more useful anyway. Alright, so these guys, yeah, I'd really like Heather to deal with them, but I think I want Renolf to deal with them as well as I uh, think. And Har. Uh, what do they I don't think they have anything. Uh, you have a Worm Slayer, but ha, Har is not a Worm this time. Worm, Worm, however you want to say it. Uh, you're not going to attack Har. Oh, 
it's kind of bad against you. Mm, that's a shame. The strength is only at 19. Uh, Heather will roast you. Quite literally, she'll roast you alive. I guess I'll let Ike shift. Maybe just get this over and have Heather, um... Just roast one of them. Uh, I don't think I need Leth anymore. I want that tiger move. That's what I really need. Are you not going to move? Thank you. Well, it was all for a coin, but worthwhile. Um, if Titania comes in, can Har do anything else? I can definitely get this one. Definitely want to build their support since they're going to be spending a lot of time together, no doubt. I want to keep this recording under an hour as well, but I do have to merge it with, uh, thank you, Babies. I do have to merge it with the, uh, starting, uh, the intro, the intro, ugh. Talk correctly, please. Um, let's see if Heather can roast. She actually doesn't do that great. Uh, she can definitely roast you. How does Renolf do against you? Not too great either. Um, I think I'm gonna just roast this one. And then have Renolf start working on, uh, the boss. It's actually one short of one-shotting right now, but that kind of happened a lot in the last episode. Heather and Nephni are making a great team. Who would've thunk? Heather, Nephni, Renolf, Ike. Great pairings. Fantastic pairings, I'd say, even. Ah, uh, yeah, you can actually, um... You can actually... <laughs> no, I'm a general this time. You can actually, uh... Hit left pretty hard with that, I imagine. And he's a Meg. It seems to be a running theme with a lot of the generals randomizing into Meg. Of all people. I mean, nothing wrong with being Meg. Meg is great. I really want to use her, though. I guess we can go for this. I don't really know if there's any point. I mean, I getting a boss kill would at least help his experience. Well, we will survive, and we get an Ike. Yeah, conversation. I don't remember if it was in the recorded episode, but uh, that uh, bulletin guy from last episode did go for Ike. It's kind of funny when they have a conversation across the map. Sorry, Meg, not a wyvern. And Pavise helped you that time, so Pavise giveth and taketh away. Uh, yeah, we're, we're hurrying. Um, Alright. Guess you're going for Ike again. Oof. Oh yeah, he did have that Brave Lance equipped, so that could have been really dangerous. Um, I'd like to give this to Nephni, if anyone. Hopefully the NPCs will cooperate. Yeah, let's give it to Nephni. And I guess Heather can get one more heal in just so she can... Ah, uh, work on her staff rank a little bit more. Please get strength this time. No, that's really irritating. Uh, did you cap anything else? If you can cap, Nephni, if you can cap things, I can easily fix your strength. Uh, Alright, well, hi, here you go. Very nice. Uh, great, so we, we can use men now, even better. Alright, uh, got everything. Let's have Renolf wait, and yeah, we have to both wait, so and that should be it, I think. Um... Oh, we have to hit arrive, duh. Well, that'll do it for this episode, and I will see you next time.